What's goody? It's me, and I'm back at it again looking bald. Jeez. What's up, y'all? It's Dairy Jane. I'm back at it again with another video. A video. What's goody, y'all? It's Dairy J, and I'm back here again with another video. So today, I'm coming back to you live and bald, you know, because we have to do a wig review. So I was contacted by Dress Elite to do a review on their wigs, and all of these wigs are under $20. I'll make sure to have, like, the picture of the, what the wig should have looked like. With that being said, why am I saying this? Because I knew what to expect when I was deciding to do this review. I knew that the quality of these wigs was not going to be up to par. And also I just want to mention that I really don't appreciate that they have these pictures on their website that like really rear you in because they're like oh my gosh these are so cute and they're so cheap and then you get them and they look nothing like the picture. I don't appreciate that at all. So be expecting a video. I'm going to do some synthetic wigs under $30 and they're going to look bomb. But I still want to show you guys because some of these might end up turning out looking you know good or whatever. But yeah so I'm going to have the price on the screen as well as a picture. I got eight of these wigs and they're all under $20. And I feel like as a company you should know what your, what your customers want. And like I just really don't feel like even me not purchasing from this website i will i feel like i would be disappointed either way if i like expected my wig to look like this and then it comes looking like trash let's just let's just open this video because i feel like i'm talking too much and like yeah so we just did i say let's open this video i hope i didn't say that because that's really embarrassing they all come in like these packages and these are all synthetic wigs Oh, crrr, something. All right. So I got this. Wait, let me see. See this. Maybe sis. You know. Oh, ooh. Okay. Static. Static. But yeah. So here's the wig. I got this blonde wig with like some dark roots. Oh, this is so shiny. I know y'all see that. Okay. We gonna try it on. It's soft. Like you can actually comb through the hair. You know, got some. Okay, let me stop because I don't know how to act. Look at this part, y'all. Like, whose scalp is this white and thick? It's okay. We're gonna pop this on. It has um, it's a full wig, as you can see. It literally has like this baby doll closure and some adjustable straps in the back, but that's about it. So we just go and pop her on. This literally, if y'all, oh my gosh, this it's it's so soft, but it literally feels like Bratz doll hair. Just because you know your girl grew up on the Bratz dolls. Like you feel me? I can comb through it, kinda. Is okay. I don't even know how to make this look natural. Here's the part. All right. People said you know you can add some concealer or whatever to make it look natural. This is the length of it not gonna lie it is long hmm maybe it could be a look i just don't think okay maybe if i like actually put this on like i want it to actually wear it it could be cute or like with a hat or something i feel like a lot of these are like hat wearers you know a hat wearing wig so hopefully nobody snatch your hat off because these are just gonna be like and they're gonna be like you're gonna be like and you gonna start crying but I ain't feeling it. But you know, for pictures, I think this will be bomb. Like one of those like commercial wigs or whatever. Cosplay wigs or whatever. So it'll be cute. Would I recommend it? If you wanted a blonde wig and you just needed it like for a night or something, then yeah. But like just to wear out regularly, just throw it on and go. I don't know. And it is getting like super tangly already let's pull another one out the bag so this one came with a liner weight cap which is nice Ooh, look at that fat curl hmm, cute so the only thing i can really say because that is really pretty i love the color the color is really bomb but like these parts are what throw everything off like whose scalp looks like that anyway this is like a burgundy like cranberry looking really pretty color this color is the bomb these curls are the bomb 
I just feel like, you know, since my makeup is not done today, maybe that plays a huge factor. But, I mean, these curls are popping. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. Like, these curls are literally popping. And, you know, it's a little tangly. But, like, the hair is not bad. Like, besides the parting and everything, like, I feel like you could get this off. Like, this could be bomb pictures. Like, look. Like, y'all gotta feel it with me. Like, as long as you're feeling it with me. Ooh. Ooh, serving looks. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I just really wanted to try out colors. I felt like this was, like, a great way to like try on some color wigs or whatever i love this color though honestly i would definitely go with this color if i wanted to get some color this is like really bomb it's like a perfect like mix between a red and a purple mm -mm. it's beautiful so yeah i really like this one again besides the freaking part looking so unnatural like if you didn't show the part like people would think you just had like some really bomb weaving but I just don't appreciate how the picture is human hair and you send me this. Yeah, so this is a curly wig. I only got one curly wig. And I believe this one has bangs. I literally don't know who I look like right now. I think I look like Rick James. Okay, we're going we're gonna to make this one work because I actually have hope in this one. So we just going to... Got hair falling out. We're going to have to cut some bangs. I think I cut those way too short. <laughs> okay, I literally look like Rick James. I literally just cut my bangs like way too short. And this wig had so much potential and I just cut all of this hair off. I just feel like this wig has potential like the curly wigs like really have potential in my opinion i don't i don't like curly hair with these bangs the curls look good like i'm not even gonna lie to you the curls look fine but just the way i probably just cut these bangs and everything i ain't really feeling it bring them baby hairs now not looking bad at all not too bad not too shabby it could work it could work sis i won't go with a complete no because it can work see some color bright blue baby i don't even know if this was supposed to be this blue but we're gonna try it on anyway it looks like a costume wig like that's for sure and the hair in the picture was definitely human hair like you could just tell so let's just pop it on see what we working with i think a lot i think these wigs in particular are good for photo like just to wear out every day they feel literally like baby doll hair the cut is nice and i think the color is really pretty but the hair itself is just it doesn't do it for me it just doesn't look realistic at all dark roots and then it goes down to this really pretty red color again i love the colors like i absolutely love the colors but the construction of these wigs are like so cheap and put together and i guess you know honestly you get what you pay for but i promise like i'm going to bring you guys another video where it's going to be actually like nice wigs for really cheap so Be expecting that really soon. I feel like this is like those synthetic wigs that you literally cannot put heat on at all. Because if you do, you'll probably burn your whole house down. Like, seriously. But yeah, here's the back. I haven't really been showing the back of these wigs. But they just, do you see how shiny they are? They look like baby doll hair. But yeah, because they kind of are baby doll hair. <sighs> look at this one, y'all. It's orange got the colors to pop in today but oh no look at this girl so the color looks a lot like the picture i can honestly say like i just don't 
maybe it's because my makeup is not done all the way like i literally just have on my mascara so like like i can comb through this hair but i don't know It just looks like an anime wig. Like, it's not something that I can see myself wearing every day. But again, it's a really good wig, I think, for pictures because it's colored. And, like, maybe with a hat or something. But other than that, I just can't see myself wearing this, like, every day. <sighs> okay, so I got this short wig. Look at that. Look at this. Um, I don't even know where the front is. Oh, no, no, no. Oh no, no, I don't even want to look. Oh. oh no, Johnny. Who is Johnny? I don't know. I've never had short hair in my life. So like maybe it's just, you know, some getting used to. Maybe it's just, you know, something that I have to like. I really don't think it's that bad. Oh my gosh, I'm I'm trying so hard to make this look good. If you want, you know, a short hair look, try it. This wig was really inexpensive, so try it. Guys, it's still the same day. I just changed my shirt because I had to wait for this other package to get here and it got here like so freaking late but i filmed the first half of this video like today but i just changed my shirt because i knew for a fact that first of all i just looked really basic and boring in the beginning like what was i thinking putting on a black shirt you know barely got on makeup so and i also knew that i had a black wig so it also came in a hairnet super long it literally said like ultra long or like just super long black wig and as you can see it's black oh baby oh baby do you see how silky it is like it's not even like a ooh, that's like some good hair that's some expensive hair type silky like no it's like baby doll hair silky if you felt it i don't even know how to describe this texture besides saying that it feels like a halloween wig again i'm giving my honest opinion like whenever i come to y'all for with reviews and things like that i don't care how much a person pays me to do a review or anything like that i will always and forever give my honest opinion because that's just the type of person that i am and then again i feel like you know when i watch other people's videos i will want the same like if you recommend me to go buy a product i'm gonna hope that you know it's good but you can literally see as a visual first of all the hair is already like shedding like crazy oh it's super tangly at the ends it is long it's really long these are cheap they're very cheap very inexpensive but they're not realistic at all the texture is just not realistic if someone like came up to you it literally looks like baby doll hair it feels like baby doll hair like the texture is just it's ridiculous i don't like it at all i don't like this feeling at all there's no clips in this hair at all all it is is ad adjustable straps so that's all you have to work with now again with maybe dark hair like this you could probably put concealer take out your baby hairs but this is super thick like this right here is so freaking thick it's like not realistic at all again something that you could like throw a hat on with and just you know do some quick errands sure why not but like to actually just wear mm -mm. again they ship really really fast um they have really really inexpensive wigs but just all i'm saying is if you're going to sell me a wig make sure that it looks like the picture make sure that it looks like what i thought i was going to get because it's not fair that you know if you look at the picture this wig looks bomb like okay who is that this right here I look like the Wicked Witch of the West with this long black hair. And it literally looks like the ends of my hair are going to come grab somebody. Like, what? what is going on, Dressily? I'm not feeling it. Like, I'm just, you know, when I want my long 28 inches, I want them to look nice and somewhat realistic. Even if I'm paying, you know, however much. Because I actually don't know how much this wig was. 
but it was under $20. So even if I'm paying under $20, I would like my wig to look decent so yes i really hope you guys enjoyed this video again i'm not here to bash this company at all i just feel like they should know what they are doing so make sure you guys give me your honest opinions down below if you're new to my channel again welcome to join the dairy bag gang just make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell down below so you can know when i post and if you're not new welcome back gang squad fam y'all know what it is you already know what's going on we are on the road to 20k literally like i can't wait i'm really about to hit 20k like i'm telling y'all I'm going to hit 100k and I will hit 100k. I will hit 100k by the end of this year. As long as I keep being consistent and upload every Saturday like I've been doing, I will hit 100k by the end of this year. And that's facts. That's facts. But yes, I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for like 16.5k, I think. Like, literally my last video I had 15k. Now I'm at 16.5k filming this video. Like, what? Hold on, child. Hold on. Hold on, baby. I will leave all the links to these wigs in the description box so you guys can check it out. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Make sure you guys leave video suggestions down below. And follow all my social media, which I'll also leave in the description box. So thanks again and God bless you all. I love you guys so much. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!